Welcome to the history of movie theater and drive-ins for Chicago and Cook County for 1950 to 1959. 1950. The four-screen drive-in in Riverdale is opened on June 16th by SNS Theaters as the only four-screen in the world. Marx and Rosenfield opens the double drive-in on August 19th. SNS Theaters opens the ABC Outdoor in Posen on October 19th. The Ziegfeld reopens at the Old Sonatone Theater on November 24th. These theaters also opened in 1950. The Telenus Theater becomes the loop on August 8th. The Prospect Theater in Mount Prospect opened on December 26th. The Ace Theater becomes the Chem Theater on December 31st. These theaters closed in 1950. 1951 The M and R Sunset Drive-In in Skokie opened on July 22nd. These theaters closed in 1951. 1952 The Sunsing Theater reopens showing Chinese movies at the Old Rita. These theaters closed in 1952. 1953 These theaters closed in 1953. 1954 The Milo Theater becomes the Tetrio Villa showing Spanish language movies. These theaters closed in 1954. 1955 The Park Avenue in Park Ridge opens and closes by the end of the year. The Balaban and Cat Stadium Theater in Evanston becomes the Evanston Theater on July 1st. These theaters closed in 1955. 1956 On March 2nd, the Marx and Rosenfield Bel Air Drive-In in Cicero opens as the world's largest drive-in at the time. These theaters closed in 1956. 1957. Balaban and Katz bought a half page at for the new marquee of the United Artists Theater on January 2nd. On April 4th, the Cinestage Theater is reopened at the Old Solwyn Theater by Michael Todd for Around the World in 80 Days. The Avon Theater reopens showing Greek movies. 
The Michael Todd Theater reopens on December 26th and starts to show movies in 1959. These theaters closed in 1958. Nineteen fifty nine. The Sheridan Drive In and Bridgeview opens on November twenty seventh. These theaters closed in nineteen fifty nine. Thanks for watching and remember to like and subscribe.